Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have API 3 daily update. We are going to see the next price targets. And of course, before we continue, do not forget to join our monthly subscription to get easy profits trading. 200 altcoins through our automated system with buying and selling opportunities. You will find the links in the description box. You can either join Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto, buy me a coffee slash Mind Your Crypto, or our site, buildmindyourcrypto.com, and you will get amazing benefits, including live trading, minor system with over 90% win ratio, personal guidance every day, educational videos to become expert in the technical analysis and hold your future in your hands, market updates, random giveaways, pine scripts for trading view, and many, many other benefits. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day wherever you are. Let's proceed quickly into our technical analysis. API 3 USDT. Right now we are going to see a little bit the risk metrics. And the reason we might be correcting a little bit is because we approached the 100 on the commodity channel index. You can see if I zoom in, you can see that this purple line is at the top of this gray zone. Okay. And when we go above, we, it means that we have an overbought situation. That means too many buyers have, ste have stepped in and we expect the sellers to step in pretty, pretty soon enough. But by the way I'm seeing things right now, I will tell you the most important resistance level to pay attention to. And of course, if we go above this, then we can go to the next price targets and you can take an, a nice swing trade. Of course, none of these are financial advices, just my personal humble opinion. So we can go to the Fisher Transform above the two, above the zero. You can see we have the line, so it is very neutral. We do not have any overbought. And the stochastic say we can grow potentially even, even more. Let's go to AP13 Bitcoin chart right here. And you can see that we should be going above this line right there. And we could go towards the 0 0.303510. Okay, we have though a very high risk with the daily frame, seeing the daily chart and the four hour frame as well. So you should be careful. It is not easy to go past above the AP, uh, this 0.618 Fibonacci retracement, drawing our Fib from 16 January 2022 to 17 January 2022 as well. So we are going there, we approached a little bit above, you can see here on 18 January, but right now we are making a little bit of a lower high pattern. We will see if though we are keeping the high low as well, and we have a breakout towards the next price target, the 0 0.303510. Okay, in the meantime, though, we have a little bit of a lower high in the RSI as well, but at the same time, we have a higher low. So we are getting into a squeeze point. Okay, lower highs, higher lows. We will eventually know uh, if we break out above or we break down and we are going to the most important resistance level on the short term. And that is the 0 0.786 Fibonacci retracement. Okay, the reason we found sell pressure is this line right here, the 0 0.786, which is the 4.728 for AP13. And you can see that APY3. Okay, so you can see that we are having right now a little bit of a bank pressure, but we have to close first above this line. If we can manage to do that, then we can go for sure towards the next price target, which is the 5.13, the 5.26, and maybe the 5.62. However, we have to close above. And what it means to close above? It means that the body of the candlestick in this four hour frame or in the next four hour frames, okay, it has to close above. The closing price should be above the 4.728, not the highest price, but the closing price, it is different, okay? So if we manage to do that, we can even eventually go even, even higher, okay? And we could possibly be going into the next price targets, of course, right here, we have also the commodity channel index into an overbought. As you know, we hold a little bit of a high risk, but not so much. Okay, We do not hold such an important high risk on the daily frame. On the other hand, we have the commodity channel index in an overbought situation right there. So yes, according to the commodity channel index, we should be careful and we should be going on only if we close above 4.72 Eight, if we can manage to do that, then we could go potentially to the next price targets you are seeing on your screen, 5.12, 5.27, 5.63 
Tether USD. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day wherever you are. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Links in the description box and you will find in the comment section the um, site as well. Okay, BillMindYourCrypto.com. Thank you. See you soon with many, many more videos. Bye.